Hey guys, hope you're having a great day today. All right, it is Friday in our household and it is a burr cold morning. I left all my windows open last night and I woke up and I was like, oh my goodness, I'm frozen. So I don't do well when it's cold. <laughs> it's funny, I grew up in Michigan my whole life. Didn't mind the cold, I guess. Like I would go outside, just run outside real quick without a coat on, not even think about it. But now when it gets like below 70, I am frozen. So I'm enjoying my cup of coffee this morning. I made my whipped cream yesterday, remember yesterday's video, with almond flavoring. That makes the coffee delicious. So I am loving that. I'm sure you could make basically flavored creamers. I like the whipped cream. It just gives it something frothy about it. I don't know. So maybe if you whipped it in there, a different flavor. I don't know, pumpkin. I'd be a little flavorings. I mean, all different kinds of delicious. So that is a delicious treat. So I got up, um, I slept in today. Yesterday I told you I wasn't feeling the greatest. You guys know it, it wasn't feeling the greatest. And so I just took my allergy pill last night, took some more Motrin, woke up today and I'm like, you know what? I wasn't feeling anything, but I'm like gonna take an allergy pill. So I took another one, got some Motrin. And I'm like, okay, I feel good. So I slept till about 6.45 today, which was good. When you know you need that sleep, you get that sleep. And then I went and worked on um, emails. I had to answer emails, text, and comments. And then I did abundantly blessed this morning. So now I'm done with next week's video, which is awesome. I'm trying to keep on that. Stay consistent so it's not all stressed out. So then I'm like, okay, it's going on eight here. I got to make sure um, everybody's up, get everything set. Cause today is my day for Lauren to um, watch the kids, which is awesome. So she will take care of the home. I've got a list for her over here. I've got food, breakfast, lunch, and dinner that she's breakfast and lunch that she's gonna make with the kids. And I'll do dinner cause I'll be home. And Jaden and I are gonna go out today. So she is the last child to get her clothes. <laughs> and so she's been so busy. So she has an eye appointment today for her that I'm gonna take her to. And then um, we're gonna go shopping for clothes. She's the simple one. She's like, mom, I need some jeans. I need socks, underclothes, and a black hoodie. I'm like, okay, <laughs> so easy enough. No sense, I'm always like, well, let's buy this top, let's buy this. And she's like, I have found that teenagers wear the same outfit over and over. And I mean, they wear different ones, but let them wear the same thing don't waste your money mamas and so we're gonna do that this morning pick up a few things from the store not a whole lot but just a few things and then we'll be back home and then we'll do more food i'm gonna make my 10 kid taco chili today i am going to make dinner we're gonna do gyro patties and leftover potatoes it says so it's gonna be an easy day so yesterday jay made a letter board for me two days ago and then i didn't use it yesterday because it was just showing to you know I was talking more about not feeling good and you just gotta keep pushing through so today I share hers hers was in the search of light you must go through darkness Jaden so deep I love it and that's true the light the light is Jesus right some of you can see the light right away just follow it but some of us have to go through that darkness to find that light right and I know my prayer all the time is Lord reveal more and more light because God doesn't just blast you with this big giant light to say here it all is because it would freak you out <laughs> but he reveals a little bit more kind of like a little pinhole light like the flashlight when you're a kid and you twist it it's got the little beam and then it spreads out more and more and more and you can see your path is brighter and brighter that's what it is right you want to be praying that god shows you more and more light on things and revelations of things in your life because we want to get that light you will be walking that light you'll be walking in darkness because you can't see you're going from here and there you're running into things you're stepping in holes you're stepping in ruts going to things you shouldn't be going in you want to stay on that path of light and stay focused where god has you it's a good place to be so thank you jane for in the search of light you must go through darkness love it so good my kids are the creative ones all right so today i'm going to close the door here I'm going to, I'm not gonna show you anything I'm gonna do this morning, basically. Just get out my school for the kids. Um, I'm going to, I'm gonna put the biscuits in the oven right now because it's getting a little bit later and the kids will be hungry. And um, get myself ready so we can get out the door. We'll leave in about 20 minutes. So it's gonna be a good day. I'll bring you along and we'll go catch some fun. You guys ready? Let's go. All right, here we are. Jaden! Jaden's stuck in the car with me today. She's like, don't forget the camera, Mommy. <laughs> So good. We're gonna go shop. Or actually, we're gonna go to the eye doctor first, and yeah. then we'll go shopping afterwards. So we're gonna go there and sit for two hours and do that fun. Yay! Get her eyes all big so when I take her shopping, she can't see anything like I didn't. <laughs> be like, Jane, this looks beautiful on you, and she'd be like, Why did I buy that? <laughs> we're gonna go do that now. I get so caught up in the middle, thinking of drowning in those blue eyes. I'm losing sight because I am falling. I'm so deep down. Deep down, and it's not a lie that I die. I can't hide what this is. Oh, yeah, I keep drowning in those blue eyes, and you can tell me all of your lies. I will. 
All right, I'm in the same position I was two weeks ago. I think I was here. And Jaden, she's with me. She can't see. Hello, Jaden. I can see. I'm just kidding. I'm like, Jaden, just follow my voice. You can follow me. <laughs> no, she's good. So she got some glasses, some Yay. cute ones. So they'll be ready in a couple weeks. So blue. Yeah. She went with blue. I was like, Jaden, she didn't want to go like purple or something? She, or black? The black. It's good. Now I'm trying to find some for me. I went in there. I'm like, I like these ones. And so I don't know. I just got to find me some glasses here. And they went through there. Like, you could do multi ways. You can do bifocals. You can do this or single vision. I'm like, what do I do? <laughs> I'm like, you tell me you're the doctor. Which one do I need? And they're like, well, it just depends on what you want to do. I'm like, <laughs> Why did I come? So, I don't know. I think single vision so is what you I came need. came for me. I know. Why. Well, for my appointment, I'm so confused because I don't have issues up close. It's more, I guess it's more further away. So, I guess. Um, so, distance. I guess distance is the key. But they're like, well, the doctor recommends bicycle focus for everybody. I'm like, why? So, I don't know. I think I'm just doing Google. Google? I don't know. So, I don't even know. I was going to look online and do the glasses online. I think that's what I'm looking at. Yeah. But we will see just to spend cheaper because they're awful expensive. Don't mind buying for Jade, but, you know. Mama's always after. Okay, we're going across the street to TJ Maxx. You ready? I just threw crumbs to the trunk. Let's go to T first TJ Maxx. Let's go to TJ okay. Maxx. Find some clothes. TJ Maxx. I like it. Jaden, how you doing? Are you eyes all blinded? Actually, I'm not. We found a lot of pants in there. So we found her. We didn't show anything in the store because we didn't. But we got, of course, Maxine and Rubia shoe toy. Of course. Got a sweater from Maxine because the hedgehog jammies makes her stand still and she doesn't move when you put them on her. <laughs> so yeah, the sweater stuff. will be good because she did wear a sweater last year and it did keep her warmer and so um, we did that and then we got, she got pants. She got five pairs of pants and a hoodie. And that is exactly what she wanted. So I'm like, okay, you got what you wanted, that's good. So now we are going to go ahead over to Walmart and get socks, stuff like that, and then uh, a few things we had to pick up. So we're gonna go do that. Okay, we're heading to Walmart. Okay, we went to Walmart and didn't record any of Walmart. So we got okay. Jade and her stuff, and then we had to pick up some stuff for church. And then we got some donuts and cider because of I kind of figured it's like the end of the fall. So I got to do apple cider slushies again. And the last time I got some, I got some at the cider mill and we didn't really like it. So I got real stuff from Walmart, which is awesome. <laughs> okay. So we'll do that with some donuts this weekend. That'll be a good little treat. So now we're going to go ahead, get a gas, grab lunch, and hopefully grab some cucumbers at the farmer's market. So okay. we're going to go ahead. We'll still keep doing more as the day goes on. All right, we just stopped at the farmer's market and got our last batch of cucumbers there for the season. So we'll be eating those for a few weeks. So I was glad to get it. She said they closed down. So I'm like, okay, so now we're going to go ahead to the post office box and then head home. All right, we are home now and we sat for a little bit. We talked with Lauren, all that good stuff. And so now we got, um, oh, where's the light? I don't even know the they're, they're all right here. Who <laughs> doesn't care? There we go. And so um, we are going to make dinner, but Jane first is going to make something for us. We're going to do, on Sunday we have, um, they were going to do at church, and so she's going to make a saran wrap ball. You guys done a saran wrap ball where you do this? We take a bunch of prizes and treats, and you wrap it in saran wrap. So you do that, and then you go, the kit's real fun. I think I showed how to do this last year. So all we're going to do is pass around the circle. The kids will open it up as we do it like a song or something. Then as it shuts up, they, they have to hurry up and change the ball to another person. So I'm going to use hot pads, too. That'll make it harder. So it'll be good. So she's gonna do that. I'm gonna get dinner going. We're gonna do the Euro patties. So I'm gonna get those out of the picture right now. Okay, so I got my Euro patties here. Let me get them. Just let me show you. Out of the freezer. I like this. They have spinach and feta and a bunch of spices. They smell delicious. So I'm just gonna put them in a pan and bake them in the oven instead of doing the grill today. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is get my chili ready for tomorrow. So I'm gonna bake, bake it, I'm gonna bake it in a big jam. I'm gonna get my roaster out and cook it all in there, but I have some more meat to mix up, to, to mix up, to cook. So I'm gonna put my frozen meat in my pot here and cook that on the stove. And then I have another one that's frozen, just gotta thaw it, and then I'll add it all together in my big roaster and mix it. All right, Jaden has made one entire roll. Let me go over this way, because it hurts. Of the saran wrap. This is what it looks like. 
There it is. Beautiful. That is all of this. And all this, and she did exactly one roll. I told her, I said, oh, like I would be like, oh gosh, am I gonna have enough? And so I even looked and I did have more plastic wrap, but we don't need another one because that's perfect. So that will be fun to do. All right, Jaden, one more to do. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at Maxine over here. Maxine put on her new sweater and she's got a dog bone. She's not sharing with nobody that she's growling. Maxine! She's like, oh, are you talking to me, mommy? She's got her bed all tore up. Maxine! Oh, can you hear the growl? Yeah, she's probably not happy because she's in the sweater for one. And two, she's got a bone. But she should be thankful she's got a bone and a sweater to keep her warm because it's chilly. So, it's good. All right, so I've got my meat is still cooking. I just pulled out my roaster here because this is what I'll keep it in. And I start pulling out all my cans of stuff that I'm going to need for my chili. And this is the other meat that's cooked. I just have to heat it up. Okay, I'm doing something that's taking a really long time and it probably will go a lot better if I just measured a big giant measuring thing poured in here. But I have to make sure that I have enough chili for 100 people. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is do a cup. Because I think that's about the size of a ladle here of chili. I'm thinking so. Yes. So I'm gonna count how many, I don't know how big my pot is here. So I'm gonna count out 100 cups of water to make sure that I have enough chili. I know that's the way to do it. So we're on three. Okay, so there's no way I'm gonna figure out 100 cups. So it's about 50 to about here, 50 cups. So I figure if I do again, that's 100 right to the top. That'll be a good 100 serving. So there you go. So I'm gonna mix everything in this pot, see what I have, and then I can pour it into my roaster to keep it hot, and then I'll bring this as well to keep everything, uh, just transfer to keep heating it up. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is some of my, um, my hamburgers all in my pot, see? All that, that's probably 20 pounds of hamburger, yes. And the way I figured that out was I figured that we would use um, a pound for our family, like 10 people. I know it's, you could do two pounds per our 10 people, so I just multiplied. If I do two pounds, that'd be 20. It is 20 pounds. Two times two for one person. Sorry, I'm kind of wrong. Two pounds for our family, so I figured 20 pounds for 100 people. So then I'm going to do taco seasoning here on top of my meat. I put this yesterday on top of my fries. That was not what I wanted to do. So I'm gonna use about half this, based on how much that we normally use. And then what I'm gonna do is, the recipe calls for green chilies. This is my 10 kid taco chili. So I'm making the same recipe for a long, long time. So what I'm gonna do is add tomatoes and chilies to this, and then I'm gonna let that heat up. Is that good? Oh yeah, spicy, spicy, pour that on top. Let me show you what I'm adding. Chili's looking good, I'm gonna start adding my greens. First I'm gonna add just red beans. That's chili beans.
Okay, this is gonna be super thick, so I'm gonna definitely get out some tomato paste. That's how I make chili for 100 people. I'm, I have one more can of chili beans I'm gonna add. I wasn't sure if I was gonna add it, but I am gonna add it. And then I'm gonna get some tomato paste that I have frozen, and I'm gonna put that in there with some water to make it a little bit not so thick. Okay, let me go get that. All right, so my chili is cooking over here. I'm just turning on low because it's such a big pot. And it will slowly heat up here overnight, um, tonight. I'll just let it cook all night. I know, I'll just keep it on warm. Um, what I'm gonna do is, I think it tastes good. I might just have a bit more taco seasoning. It's usually just taco and um, ranch powder. That's what makes the flavor super simple. So my meat is cooking in here for the Euro burgers. put it on um, broil for a minute so I'm kind of blackened. So that's good. I pulled up pita bread for them and I'm going to cut up some cucumbers and tomatoes for that and that'll be easy dinner. And that's it for food which is awesome. What a great time. Look at the balls Jane come up with. Oh, look at Jane got all. She got them all made. Here's one. And she was smart to girls and where to start. We never do that and then we're always like where do you even start? Start here. <laughs> so those will be fun to do. Very good. Okay, the burgers are almost done, so I'm going to cut up my cucumbers I got today, just some of them, and tomatoes to go with them. Okay, so I think I've got all my dinner stuff out now. Let me show you. I've got, I pulled up some applesauce. This is gonna have to thaw real quick. Um, this is for the burger. There's some lettuce, a little bit of pickles I pulled out. And then in here is the burgers. They look really good. And I put these in here, kind of heat up a little bit. They're almost ready. And then I had some sweet potatoes to heat up in there. Here is the big giant 100 person chili. And so that's good. So the only thing I was looking at my list, I'm like, what else do I have to do today? I just wanted to get my school out for Monday. I don't have to do that today, but since we are gonna have a busier weekend, I'm thinking I'll get it all out right now. Just get it ready, then that'll be it. I'll just have a nice, we'll just have to work on this video tonight. That's what I have to do tonight, <laughs> work on this video. And then that will be it, and then I'll have a nice chill weekend. Chill, busy, but chill. I won't have to do any little tiny tasks that I can get done during the week. So I'm gonna put the school stuff together right now. Look, Maxine, her cute sweater. Hello, Maxine. Do you love your sweater? She's like, no, I don't like any outfit that you put on me, mommy. Sweater. She's like, I'm gonna go check. What do you see? What do you see, Maxine? What was that, rubies? She likes acorn. Is that bad for her to chew on an acorn? Maxine, look at Maxine. Her and Bear just love each other. It'd be nice to Bear. Maxine. Bear is a kitty who'll just scratch you to pieces. Bear's like, what? 
I'm just gonna go in this chair and you're not gonna be able to get it. All right, this is dinner. I heated up the pita. This looks really good. The pita bread from um, Walmart. Here's the tzatziki burgers. So this with that, we have some sweet potatoes. Here is tzatziki. What I call these? I call these tzatziki burgers. Euro burgers, <laughs> sweet potato fries, tum tzatziki. And here's the toppings for the burgers. And then I just put in applesauce in the microwave for a few seconds so it can kind of thaw because it's frozen solid. So that will be good. Yeah, that's perfect. So I can break that up here. I'm going to put it in a little bowl for the kids. And my chili, I just turned it off. It tastes good as all heated up, so I'm probably going to put it in some containers and put it in the refrigerator. So let me put this in a bowl. Okay, here's the apple soup. It's all chopped up and kind of frozen for the kids. They love it. I love it this way too. It's like a slushy. Delicious. We're going to eat. Okay, I'm going to have to come over here where there's no sun in my eyes. It's a beautiful night. Just beautiful, beautiful day. Let me show you the sky. All right, so what I'm gonna do is sit up against my house here so it's not too sunny over there. It's gorgeous out here. It is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Here goes the two. Look at the two of these dogs. Maxine, Ruby's not letting Maxine have anything, and Maxine's, she thinks she's free. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do down here? Where are you going? She likes those acorns. Maxine, you love your sweater. I know you do, even though I don't think you do, you do. She's like, ooh, more acorns. So good. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we are gonna go in and have dinner. Colin, cotton. So we're gonna go in and we're gonna have dinner and then I'm gonna work on this video and that's our Friday night. So what will we do today? Probably nothing, I'm just gonna sit. I might just sit, sit and enjoy. It will take me about an hour, probably hour and a half to edit this video and then I'm just gonna sit and then I'm gonna enjoy my night with my kids. Maybe read a book because I didn't get to read today, see how their day was more because I didn't get to spend too much time because I've been working. And then um, tomorrow we're gonna get up early and I will we'll head to our community chili cook-off. Maybe I'll bring my camera and just get a couple of snippets of what we did. And then um, we're gonna come home. We're gonna do apple cider slushies tomorrow night with donuts for a treat. Cause we gotta do that one more time. And then Sunday will be church. We have a great time at church plan. Then we'll come home and it'll be a relaxing Sunday. And it's gonna be end to another great week. So next week will be another good week for our family here so i am so thankful you guys are here i hope that you enjoyed our friday i hope it gave you some motivation to get some things done and that you remember i'm trying to think of my quote was jaden's quote remember go through the to get to the light you got to go through that darkness right because yeah, you got to walk through it to get to the light somewhere but just find that light the key is find that light when you see that light you go towards it <laughs> so you guys have a fantastic day and we will see you guys on Monday and we're gonna be here tomorrow too for abundantly blessed if you want to stick around for that and that is a great way to we just read the Bible and you know it's not just read the Bible it's a way that you can transform your life so that you can have an abundantly filled blessed life and you can do it it's real simple just by reading the Word of God not a whole lot of tricky games just reading God's Word and doing it pretty cool huh so we'll do that tomorrow and if not we'll see you guys on Monday so you have a great day okay thanks for being here Friday at Amy's we'll see you next week bye bye